An accessory of the century! The Clover Infinity Loop Earrings! <laughs> huh? Wow, they look great, but, um, isn't the first rule of fashion to design clothes that are safe to wear? Safe? What do you mean? <laughs> uh <-huh. gasps> See, um, this is why it's so awesome that we're taking fashion design together. We can critique each other's projects. Like those jeans you designed, Sam. What, you don't like them? No, I love them. They're way styling, but they have so many secret pockets, it sort of screams, hello, I'm a spy in spy jeans. Uh, uh, I need to hit the little spy's room and take care of this hair catastrophe. <laughs> no admittance, ladies. This is a private restroom. Please take your business elsewhere. Private? Since when? Yeah! And why do you look so familiar? Because, losers three, he's Duke Gatlin. He's super famous for playing a bodyguard in tons of movies. And now, since I'm famous, he's my bodyguard. Hey, you're popular. We got it the first hundred times you told us. Now if your super cute bodyguard is done being a big, lean bully machine, let me through so I can fix my do. you to understand the pressures of popularity. <gasps> hey! <gasps> Every time I think Mandy can't get any worse, she just gets better at it. <gasps> ah, hello, ladies. I trust I wasn't interrupting anything important. Come on, Jer. That's never bothered you before. Yes, that is true, but it's polite to ask once in a while. <laughs> Jerry, did you have the sardine burrito for lunch again? I wanted it to be a surprise, but Oinky hasn't learned the art of stealth quite yet. Oinky! You come back to me! Dreams do come true! <laughs> Now there's a sentimental moment for the Whoop photo album. Oh, did you miss me? Did you have enough mud to play in? Do you need your little hoofies buffed? Alex really likes that pig. Oh, guys, didn't you miss Oinky? Kiss him. Oh, Alex, <laughs> stop. Oinky has to live with us, doesn't he? Nobody else could give him a better home than the three of us. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm not so sure 
sure that's a good idea, Alex. He probably wouldn't like our place. You know, not enough mud. But, 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 but he can find troubles for us. He's cleaner than a dog, and he's so cute. <laughs> Sounds like a spot of trouble. Best check it out. Whoop is receiving reports of a menacing being sighted on the beaches of Hawaii. <gasps> I never say no to a trip to Hawaii. Right, girls? <laughs> right. <laughs> right, present and ready for spawning. <laughs> Let's go to Alaska. Hawaii. There, too. Here are your gadgets for today. The Brrr bracelet, which blasts a sub-zero energy that can shatter metal. The unmuffled earmuffs, which can hear up to a 100,000 hertz range. Those may not blend in so well in Hawaii. But these will. The solar roller shades, a pair of sunglasses that store up the sun's energy and blast a destructive heat ray when fully charged. Hope they come with a fireproof case. But of course. And finally, the beach ball booties. For when you need some extra bounce on the beach. Oh, and I almost forgot. Your floating hands-free capabilities compounders. Good luck, ladies. I'll take care of Oinky until you return. <laughs> On vacation, Clover. As tempting as it is, we need to keep an eye out for trouble. Hey! Yeah! Clover! Alex! Check this out! They're tracks! Something heavy by the looks of it, and they definitely don't match any of the local vehicles. I think we're dealing with some kind of robot. But what would a robot be doing in Hawaii? with you. So step aside, ladies, or I'll make you step aside. You know I'm missing a great luau and some hunky ukulele music because of you. <laughs> Lucky for you, I gotta go. <laughs> to kidnap that guy, and he's getting away! That's what he thinks! Ding, ding! Time for round two! We have to catch up or we'll lose him! The beach ball booties! <laughs> Formation, girls! Come and get up! Is that all you got? <gasps> never give up and never surrender! Let's bring it, girls! Oh! <laughs> 
<gasps> well, I knocked a piece off of him. Nah, nah. You can't get me. <gasps> now, here's a classic from page one of the bully handbook. Eat sand. Jer and the big brains at Whoop and find out where this thing came from. Uh. Phew. Fighting that metal menace was a workout. Lucky I have a free period next so I can relax in the penthouse. <gasps> <laughs> No paparazzi. Hey. That means you, Shorty. Great job, Duke. But could you be a little more insulting huh? next time? Shorty is accurate, but barely nasty. Right, Alex? Huh? Are we clear for cafeteria? Check. How long is the latte line? Mandy, Alex, she just got up on the wrong side of the broom today. Thanks, Clover. I have to head to class, so can you drop Winky off at the penthouse? <gasps> oh. <laughs> uh. Okay, Alex. Um, but he'd better stay away from my expensive facial mud cream. You are the last one I have been seeking. Huh? Of course you have! Everyone wants to hang with Mandy, even the losers that play hacky sack in the quad. But I don't have time for this. I have an appointment for a very expensive pedicure. Listen, buddy. Nobody and no thing enters Mandy's personal space without her approval. Got it? You know what? I'd like to do that line again. I, I, I didn't really feel that one. Me neither. Hey! That was my exclusive celebrity bodyguard! He better not have a scratch on him! Someone's screaming. But it's too far away to tell where they are. Wait! Oh. That sounds like Mandy! And she's in trouble! Ugh! Why does it have to be Mandy? Alex, Sam, we've got trouble. I'm sending you the coordinates on campus now. She was right here. My earmuff said so. Look! There's her designer purse. She'd never go anywhere without it. Well, there was no one around that saw anything. A witness would be helpful. We've got the only witness we need. The returning cutest member of our super spy team, Oinky! Oink, oink. Oink, oink, oink. Oink, oink. Oh, really? That's incredible. What did he say? I have no idea. <sighs> Alex, Clover, get down 
here. I found something. It's the same tracks that we found in Hawaii. The bully bot was here. So it took Mandy? But why? Good afternoon, <gasps> ladies. Jerry, the robot was here, and it took Mandy. Then we haven't time to waste. I have the analysis of the robot armor fragment you sent me. It appears it was built from pieces of rides at the Village of Thrills Amusement Land. It's located near Mount Fujiyama in Japan. Ooh! <laughs> Thanks, Jer. Looks like our next stop is Japan. Indeed. Good luck, spies. since folks tilt a world around here. It's been deserted for years. No! But what about the... the... I'll always miss you, Cotton Candy. Only one that thinks that's a little weird, right? I think he's hiding his tracks. He could be anywhere. There's more than one way to track a robot. I can hear something. I think it might be Mandy and our kidnapped beach hunk over there. <laughs> It's coming from in here! That's the guy from the beach! But who are these other dudes? And what does Mandy have to do with this? Who's there? I've located the client. Stand down on the perimeter. I'm on the bad guys. Who are you talking to? Nobody. <laughs> Pretty convincing, right? That'll show the Academy for not recognizing my talent in the best bodyguard category. But first, I must deal with you Mandy Nappers. Us? But we did <laughs> All right, spies. Let's do it right this time. Love that hands-free mode. Can you guys hear me? Loud and clear, Sam. What do we do now? I say we break out of here and teach that mean robot some manners. Or how about you just hang out there and be quiet while I finally get my revenge? Revenge? But the first rule of robotics is that it's impossible for robots to seek revenge, which means... Who are you? My name? is Timmy! Timmy? The great, evil, scary robot is named Timmy? That's no robot! Correct! I am no robot, but merely a man in a robotic bully suit I built to get revenge on these bullies! Huh? I worked at this park years ago for one summer. It was beautiful then. I made the delicious village of thrills thrizzle blueberry flavored slushies. I loved every second of my job until these jerks showed up and ruined everything. Now I can't even look at slushies without thinking of how puny and weak I was. But her... She was the meanest and worst of them all! Look at this picture of what she did right after these bullies left! Big deal! First off, that is not me being mean. That is just me on a Tuesday. Second, what is 
with those lame outfits? Pay attention! You and these jerks were on a school trip that summer, and you did it to me every day! Oh, that's terrible! Mandy, have you ever not been a total Mandy? Timmy, we understand why you feel this way, but a robot bully suit isn't the answer. <laughs> Wrong! It's the only answer. Now it's time for the fun to really begin. Let the bully gauntlet begin! Bully gauntlet? Nothing about that. Sounds good. Just the fashion accessory to end this not so fun house. <laughs> to withstand slushies of this magnitude!
quit. I'm going back to pretending to be a bodyguard in the movies. It's way safer. You can't quit! You're fired! Come back here so I can fire you! <laughs> Good job, ladies. And don't fret, I'll take everyone back to Whoop headquarters and erase any memory of this. Is there any way you can make these guys forget to be bullies? <gasps> and while we're at it, can we make Mandy forget to be Mandy? <laughs> I'm sorry, Spies. It just doesn't work that way. Now let's be off. <laughs> Why won't you let me drive you, Mandy? I am not in the mood for carts today. Thank you very much. And 